Hi everyone, thank you so much for stopping by my channel. This is Simpy Kiwi. Um, just wanted to show you this pretty manicure that I've done. Um, I've got some little jewels on here, little beads that I have, some little pink beads, and uh, I'm stamping. But I'm going to do a dry drag marble, if you call it that, um, with some jelly polishes that I made. Um, let me go over the items that I've used. Uh, of course, I'm using uh, Queen's Liquid Tape. My uh, Born Pretty Stamp. I'm also using as a base my Funky Fingers. It's a, a white polish. It's called Gesso. I'm also using... Um, Sesh feet to seal it off. Quick dry top coat. And these are the jelly polishes that I made. This is a yellow, a purple, an orange, a red color. pink, green, and then a blue. I've already done this pinky nail. I'm letting it dry, but let me go ahead and do the ring finger. And I'm just going to do one at a time and close them up because these bottles are not very stable they turn over so easily so I'm just pretty much taking a little bit of polish off of the brush just a little bit off and, and not too much polish on the brush and just swiping the colors over the the white base and I'm not doing them in any direction just any random direction I'm sorry I'm having to lift my hand every time, but I have to close these polishes because they I had a big accident earlier. I'm just swiping them. And I'm also overlapping the colors to give that rainbow effect, the, the drag marble effect. And I'm just putting it in all any direction. the red and I think the polish has turned out pretty well So what I'm going to do next is put a uh, sesh feet on top because of course I'm going to stamp. So I'm going to put this on this one. Really simple to do. And I'm going to come back and let that dry a little bit. And then we'll go ahead and get started with the stamping. I failed to show you the plate and I do apologize. The plate that I'll be using is a new plate that I'll have in a haul. And I'll also link that 
in the um, video but this is a born pretty plate it's BPL 030 and I think this is a really gorgeous plate very pretty if you can see that let me lift it a little bit now there's a glare there we go I think that's a really pretty plate and I'm using the images right here down at the bottom all across so there's different images on different nails but I'm using the images on this bottom portion here the flowers the half flowers and um, let me let you see the right hand again and then my thumb and you'll see that I have those little beads in the middle they're the pink beads and I'll show you that when we come back I'll show you the beads that I use but I'll be right back after this dries just a little bit um, I did get my plate here and I'm gonna go ahead and start stamping uh, hopefully my camera doesn't run out but if it does you have seen what I'm the images that I'm using um, but uh, these are the beads that I'll be using to put on the ends of the flowers all right give me just a moment to get started with the stamping and I'm using the born pretty uh, stamping polish in black so on my pinky finger I'm going to be using this image over here in Okay, there's the image and let me go ahead and position that on the corner here okay um, this image right here okay that's better and I'm gonna place this in the center okay and then what I'll do after that is put a clear top coat with the wet and wild and seal it off with sesh feet and then I will of course put the rhinestones or the, the little beads in the middle uh, on the side here like I did these nails here But I just wanted to show you that really quickly. I think this turned out very beautiful. And I will put the swatch of the photos at the end of the video. Please let me know what you think in the comments section. And again, thank you so much for watching. Be blessed, guys.